Monday Health Minutes, sponsored by Valley Health. Hi, I'm Melanie Schaefer. This is Valley Health Minutes. We're so glad you're with us today. You know, routine di visits to the doctor can keep us all healthy, of course. And today we're talking with Dr. Corey Mitchell about an annual wellness visit for adults and how that can be a real game changer. Tell me how important this is. Oh, it's, it's vital. And as a primary care provider, it's certainly uh, something that I pay a lot of attention to. And uh, having, a, having an annual wellness visit with your provider is an opportunity to not only update your, your medical information, but to, to really uh, hone in on what your preventative care plan needs to be. So tell me, what do we walk through during this annual wellness visit? What does sure. it look like? What are you checking? Yeah, absolutely. So an annual wellness visit, as the name implied, would be a, a yearly visit that we do. Uh, and we're going to look at uh, a kind of a, a big picture view. Um, sometimes we look at our routine visits as more a, a problem-based. It may be following up on, um, say, hypertension or high cholesterol or diabetes. But with an annual wellness visit, we're able to take a bigger picture uh, view of your overall health. We're going to be looking at everything from uh, not only your physical health, but your behavioral, uh, and psychological, emotional health. Um, and this allows us to look at you know, appropriate screenings, um, things like immunizations, maybe even lab work, uh, to, to, to really personalize uh, your preventative uh, health care plan in a way to uh, not only uh, look at your health, but to maintain your health. So a lot of people would say, I feel fine. I can just wait another year, but those increments of a year really keep you on track. Sure. So I, what I would say to that, and then we hear that a lot, mm -hmm. um, we really want to take a, a, a focus of preventative health care. Um, I think that is vital, um, something that we may not have always been good at in the past. Uh, and preventative health care, as the name implies, can prevent a lot of medical conditions. And if you have medical conditions, it can uh, keep those conditions be from becoming worse. And so, you know, we want those folks to come in, even if things seem to be going okay. Uh, we want you to be able to come in and, uh, and take a look at uh, what we're doing right and be able to maintain those steps uh, to, again, uh, make sure that your health care is on track. Just kind of small tweaks that can keep Absolutely. you on track. Absolutely. How hard is it to make an annual wellness visit? Does the office reach out to you? Do you reach out to your physician? Sure. So uh, it's, it's an easy process. Process. We do have folks in place that are uh, monitoring those things and they can reach out to patients to make reminders. Uh, but there's also several opportunities that, as a patient that you have to do that. Uh, obviously, you can talk directly with your primary care provider and, and, and work with them directly to schedule. Um, we have uh, uh, multiple locations, uh, Valley Health. You can reach out to any number of those locations and our front office staff would be uh, happy to schedule those. And then um, more recently, we've had access uh, with a, uh, a portal called MyChart. It's a wonderful access point for our patients and you can uh, you can log into your portal and you can schedule appointments from that from that standpoint as well annual wellness visits for adults but what about the senior population and those on Medicare what does that appointment that look like for them sure absolutely uh, it's very important uh, it's much like the annual wellness visit sometimes we refer to it as a Medicare wellness visit again as the name implies uh, this is a, a wellness visit that is covered by Medicare for our Medicare recipients um, it's it's structured much like the, a typical wellness visit but there's a few little key differences for our senior population and uh, we get to cover uh, in addition to the the typical uh, preventative health measures measures we're also looking at things like fall risks we're looking at cognition measuring cognition um, and just looking at what potential um, what we call ADLs activities of daily living things that might be uh, needing of, of assistance right and so uh, some of these things become uh, important for our senior population and so the Medicare wellness visit uh, provides that little extra uh, prevention care that we uh, we can we can offer our folks mm -hmm. and sometimes as we age we don't realize that little indicators in your daily life say you might have a problem it's everybody has a hard time getting upstairs yes. but sometimes that means you need some medication too absolutely yeah we see oftentimes uh, and I've said this to my patients before you know sometimes you don't in a 15-minute visit uh, it may it may some things may not be obvious in that in that span of conversation but when we're able to apply some of these specific screening tools you may pick up on a little bit of that uh, cognitive decline that nobody else has seen. Or you might pick up on that little bit of that uh, unsteadiness uh, in, in our fall risk assessments that um, had we not found before, might result in a fall and say a hip fracture, which carries a lot of morbidity, mortality. So those are the kinds of things that, again, preventative health care uh, can allow us to avoid. And that annual visit, that deeper dive that can keep you on the right yes. track. All right, thank Absolutely. you so much. We sure appreciate it, Dr. Mitchell. Thank you. Thanks for being here for Valley Health Minutes. I'll see you next Monday.